This is ABC, Allen Broadcasting Company from London. Today, let's discuss the book Are You Fully Charged by Tom Roth. In the book, uh, the author tries to uh, describe how to improve one's quality of living. For that, he what he means, uh, what for that he suggests three critical points: that one should have meaning, should have a meaningful li uh, life, and uh, he should have many in uh, positive interactions b with the people around him, and give and uh, and live with full of energy. Let's look at the first uh, first point. That is meaning. How to create meaning, uh, deep and sustainable meaning for your life. For that, for to find the meaning, we have to find the center point of where our passions, our uh, talents, and uh, then what the world needs meet together. So then, what if you find that point, and if you work work hard for achieving that goal, you will automatically find the meaning of your life. Then, well, once you find, once you, so what, what, what at last means that your meaning of life should actually benefit somebody, a person, a person, or maybe the whole world as such. Then you will actually find the true meaning of your life. Now, just to give you another mention that is about your strength or your talents, make sure that uh, you work to improve your strengths and talents rather than working on your weaknesses because if you try to work on your weaknesses you are wasting your time to just become like a normal person but whereas if you work to improve your strength you will be the standing out of the crowd and uh, that will be benefit beneficial for you now coming to the second point interactions to have positive interaction with the have many positive interactions with the people around you and creating good moments now this creating good moments what I mean is that it's not about having one good big moment in life the better thing to do is to have short good good moments all together then you will be generally happy more than just being happy for one instance so for that what he says is even if it is short as three seconds that is more than enough make sure that those three uh, those three seconds are uh, are meaningful he says even if you spread a smile that is more than enough to actually uh, to make use of that good three seconds then another thing what he said was the uh, phone in interference have you ever noticed that when you are speaking to someone you automatically get a discussion when the the other person is using using his phone well, the same thing applies to you. When somebody is talking to you, if you use the phone, he will, or he or she will also feel offended. So the best thing is to avoid uh, avoid any uh, interference of the phone when you spend quality good time with uh, with the person and you develop the interaction. So you can create more positive moments and actually uh, build the interactions with you, you and your world more stable. The third point is energy. We have to create and have good energy to have to you know actually to have a meaningful life or to do interactions if we don't have energy then there is no point use. Then so how can you build good energy in you? For that I, uh, do you remember the things what I told, to, uh, told you in the previous video? For that we have to do, what we have to do is to eat healthy, move what is required and sleep adequately. So if you are going to eat healthy and good food, that will give you the energy to actually move, to do a proper exercise and uh, to keep you moving. And once you have uh, exercise, your, blood, uh, your body has more blood. Um, what is it? The brain is getting blood, and you all automatically become more energetic. And once you have, once you are moved, uh, once you have exercised and moved a lot, you actually get a good night's sleep. So when these three things happen together, 
you yourself is having a positive energy, builds a positive energy into you and you actually lead a very good life. So what he says is that you have to live the moment. You, uh, you're not supposed to create a, 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 um, a goal that is very distant to you or very far away or very hard to get. Because uh, in the long term you will actually get, get fed up and you will, uh, you will stop it there. So better is to live the moment. You eat healthy to have a good dinner or you exercise so that you will feel better. So it's for that day, for that instant, what is the best thing you can do. Now when you're coming, uh, when, when you're saying this, uh, you have to eat, you have to work. Well, the best thing is to divide every hour into two segments. The first 45 minutes where you use your full focus and energy and you do the work or the task. And then use the rest 15 minutes just to uh, re, uh, just to, uh, just to focus, just to take a rest and stabilize your mind. So when you do this 50, 45 plus 15, you actually can focus your energy and your mental strength and do well uh, in that 45 minutes or in the next 45 minutes. So what? Uh, so when you when you build up energy, you are actually improving your health. That is both physically and mentally. So now when these three things, when you have a meaningful life and you have uh, many positive interaction with the people around you and uh, your a lot of energy in yourself you actually are you become fully charged so this is what uh, tom rath wanted to convey to us so i hope the, you can uh, take some good points out of this actually you're supposed to take everything of this and actually try to implement it in your life and you can actually see and feel the difference in you. Thanks for watching. Thank you.